Hi everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Bat and Kytos. So I think that's enough uh, side quests for now. I'm going to head to Inoue Nue and we're going to continue the plot. There are some sort of fetch quests we haven't done. So the pickup line you give to the sad man in the bar in the fishing village. I didn't do any, I didn't look up what happens with the hours of children. What other ones have we definitely missed? Off the head, top of my head, I can't think of that many more that we've missed. I'm sure there are plenty. Don't I couldn't I did actually check the walkthrough for the naughty novel. It didn't have any solutions for it either. Or the golden pickaxe. Oh, the pickup line has aged to an outdated pickup line. So I think we've probably done with that. Oh. We've stuck with it forever, but we've completed the quest. Why not make it a quest? Oh, why not just make it a key item then, game? Stupid thing. Go, oh, we're like one minute in. And it's made absolutely no sense. We've completed the family tree. What do we need it for? I have completed it, haven't I? I haven't made the wrong save. Complete, yep, yeah, look, complete. But I can't get rid of it. Uh, that's better than Kytos for you in a nutshell, isn't it? I've got to say, as much as I really, really like some elements of this game, just the, the sheer annoyingness of it really does my head in. What are you doing here? What a wonderful view. We need your help in preventing this world from falling into darkness. The final battle will soon begin. Good luck. Mizuti is really the best. I believe in you, great Mizuti. Mizuti will save the world. You can count on me too. I can help in all kinds of ways. Like helping the injured soldiers. Actually, we could probably level up. I'm glad everyone's safe. Thank you, Mizuti. But I never expected Key would do such a thing. I thought he was only a kind but naive boy. A child can grow up fast without his parents even noticing that he's become an adult. I can't help being sentimental and thinking of him as a child. Thank you, Mizuti. I'm sorry. He seems to have caused you more trouble than help in the past. But he seems to have learnt his lesson. When I looked in his eyes, they were shining as bright as ever. Your mother talks like that, but deep down she understands you. You can call yourself Great Mizuti if you like. Be strong as a child of the earth. Still, I'm worried about you, Mizuti. Sometimes you try to do more than you can handle. Mizuti, you tend to get carried away, but remember we're always proud of you, Mizuti. Always be true to yourself. You're our pride and joy. I don't know what cards we're going to get given, uh, so I'm not going to do the deck until we're actually in a combat area. But we might not get another chance to save. Might not get another chance to visit a church. Let's do that now. Whoops. Bit of a weird mix of level ups, but I'll take it. Ah, I'm not going to heal Gibari, he'll be just fine. Uh, I doubt we'll get much more equipment. But equally, I don't really want the cursed items, do I? I mean, Goldfish Bowl looks better. 
I'm sure I worked it out. We definitely got good earrings, didn't we? I mean, that looks a lot better. No resistances, but it doesn't confuse you. We'll save the confused ones for when there's uh, enemies that do a lot of status on us. And you've got the option of a lot of good equipment. That's the one I was just given. And it is better, but it's not crazy better. Just to make you aware, I'm not sure how many more of these we're going to get, but we haven't done badly filling out this. I mean, it looks like we've got some more top weapons. They might even be in the last dungeon. It's the same for a few. Look, there's more top weapons here. So some of those we might get, some we've obviously just missed. Got some more top defensive items by the looks of it. We've deliberately missed all the yells, I don't miss them. But we're doing okay, we've missed the odd spell. I don't know why we've got no green level fours. But actually, we've done a fairly good job of filling out the Magnus the Gathering. A few equipments, quite a bit of food, because I don't really take the food. This is our present for the star maps by the looks of it, fill all of those out. And some junk that we haven't got. I tend not to collect the junk. I suspect these recipes are some of the fetch quests we haven't done. Because we generally get those, don't we, from um, the fetch quests. Photos, we missed out a lot of the early game. But the later we got on, I think the better we did with those. We missed some quest magnuses, but not a lot of those either. they're not completionists. We actually haven't done a bad job at all of seeing the game. I know one of the quest magnuses we haven't got is the Warrior's Mementos evolves into Warrior's Memories or something, which is a, another just a, just a pure troll move. How would you have ever known that? Now it's a bit of a troll the way it takes up your inventory all that time, especially if you have the family tree as well. Are you ready to invade Core Hydra now? The forces of darkness have increased their attacks by twofold. We must hurry, Callus. Shall I? Yeah, we don't have any more time to waste. Let's go. Well, everyone. Our situation isn't exactly favourable. Indeed not. Each nation's food and medicine supplies are running low. Our soldiers are exhausted. They won't last forever. We have to do something. Indeed. We have little time left. Our apologies for keeping you waiting. Preparations are complete. All nations are ready. Then we've prepared in time. Well done. We appreciate your assistance. You have a plan for attacking Core Hydra Castle? You told us Melodia used the power of the Five Islands to release the End Magnus. I suggest we use that same power to counteract the power of the Evil God, and to pierce the shield surrounding Core Hydra Castle. You're suggesting that we gather the power of the End Magnus remaining in each island, and throw it at the shield? Exactly. That would be folly. Doesn't sound like a terrible idea, fight fire with fire. 
now that the N Magnus have been released, each island is barely kept afloat by its remaining power. If that power was to be depleted, the islands could fall. That would be too dangerous. We are all well aware of the dangers involved. Unless we do something soon, though, we'll all be doomed. We have to take our chances. Then you will definitely need my help. Lord Rodolfo! Did we not kill this brat yet? You came. Of course I did. How could I hide myself when there's a battle to be won? Wow, listen to him. He only agreed to help after some serious threatening on our part. <coughs> Reason is unimportant. It is your presence here that counts. By the way, what has become of the Empire? Who will take charge? Not you. We can't expect too much from them. We will have them assume their positions, just in case. Now that Gelderborn is gone, there is no one to lead the people and bring out the full potential of that island. Ah, oh, you've got Liud, you've got Savina. Could they not work as a duo? I'm not sure how much we can accomplish with the power of four islands, but we must do what we can. There's no turning back. I must have missed a side quest then. This will probably be the first and the last time anyone attempts such a feat. Let us join together and give them something to remember. As mentioned earlier, we will take care of the shield. Wait for an opening and storm directly into the core hydra. I beg of you. Please save my Melodia. Please save her soul. Oh yeah, we'll get right on that, Calvin. Yeah, that's that's our number one priority, yeah. We will. <laughs> but we'll do our utmost. <laughs> final battle will take place tomorrow. The fate of the world is in our hands. There's one thing I don't understand. Melodia and Malpercio seem to have somehow linked their minds together. Any ideas why or how? Yeah. She used Geldablame to unseal the 5N Magnus and resurrect Malpercio. No doubt about that. Maybe she was first linked with the N Magnus and Mira. That's a possibility. Yeah, thanks for that, Callus. According to Giacomo, Dr. Georg had a special power, probably induced by the N Magnus in the lava caves. He devoted himself to his experiments as if a man possessed, until he created Kallus and Fee. Hmm? What's your point? My point is that something tells me both Melodia and Dr. Georg were controlled by the will of Malpercio, whether they were aware of it or not. Yeah, maybe. Yet, if that were indeed the case, it would be quite puzzling. On one side, we have Melodia and her cohorts, Callus, attempting to unleash the N Magnus and take over the world. On the other, we have Dr. Georg, striving to create a being who could bring about Malpercio's destruction. If both are controlled by Malpercio, why would they be in contradiction? Maybe Callus wasn't really created to destroy Malpercio. I mean, he didn't. His actions so far have not been to do so. Maybe he's still going to betray us. Hmm. That is weird, now that you mention it. 
Dr. Georg's experiments were aimed at creating a Magnus of life. This would be the exact opposite of the N Magnus, which are symbols of death and destruction. My point is that Callus and Melpercio may have been destined to fight one another. In that sense, Callus could be said to be a bad omen for Melpercio, a harbinger of the gods' demise. That's the way of the world. But Callus was possessed by Malpercio once before. Come again? Everyone lives with contradictions of some sort or another. The desire to be sincere and loyal to others and the urge to drop everything, lie back, and care about nothing. Oh. We want to be free, but also want to feel secure. Mm. We want to protect someone dear to us, but at the same time, we simply want to abandon them. Mm. We want to live on, but also want to give up and die. Love and hatred. Melodia and Callus. She is Melpercio's curse to the world. Callus must be his prayer. She's his curse? And I'm his prayer? Yes. I won't claim to know for sure what Malpercio thinks and desires, but something tells me that's how it is. Callus and Melodia. Us and them. There's no telling who will win. Hell, it may not even matter who wins. Is everything just a game, determined at the whim of some god, enjoying himself at our expense? Are we just pawns caught up in the mess, whether we like it or not? No, this is no game. This is Malpercio's will. And it's his first and final decision, putting himself at stake. It's the final fight by gods who were destroyed a thousand years ago. He's dead serious, believe me. Well, this is the big day. The end of the line. Hey, listen. This may be it for us. We've been through a lot together, and it was a hell of a ride, thanks to you. I owe you one. What's with you all of a sudden? Why... You've never been all lovey like this before. Um, well... You know, I guess I've caused you a lot of trouble. We've really been through a lot, though, haven't we? I can't imagine what would have happened to us without you. Anyway, it'll all be over by this time tomorrow. Whether we manage to stop them or whether they end up killing us, everyone needs to say goodbye someday. So, before that time comes... Let's go out with a bang. We can do this, together. Okay? Let's get going. Those are all my catchphrases. I've got to say, Shella's monologue was pretty well written. I, I generally don't get the reviews that don't like the story. I mean, it's a JRPG. It's meant to pull you from one place to the next. I think it's good. I really want to kill Melodia. I'm gonna get it. I'm not sure what the point of the Memeis is. The Grey Thorns. 
you have new things to say? Yes, I think you do. Do you? No, you're the same. What? Oh. Do I go back to the main room then? Just give the word. Very well. All of you, to your positions. I wish you the best of luck. We shall give them our utmost. Yes, indeed. Let us join forces and destroy the poor Hydra castle. To walk another day with our heads held high. Shella, do you need us? I'll be fine. Please stay and protect Queen Corellia. Be careful, my queen. You too. Good luck, your majesty. Time you wish. Yes, let us begin. There's only four, we need a fifth. 
The powers of four continents weren't enough, it seems. Oh no! Why now? <sighs> Prepare yourselves. Seems. We should have stuck the Tank Clouds gang onto the Fifth Island. Not so fast, people! <gasps> what is that? It is coming from Alphard the power of its end, Magnus. But who is it? With Gelderblain dead, who would be able to invoke Alphard's power? We're in control down here. Amy! This island is in good hands. No need for worry. Don't go dying on me now. We've got incessant business. Rally yourselves, all of you. Charge! Right! Yes. Counting on you, Callus. All of us. We'll join you shortly. Please be careful. Core Hydra Castle. What the... What are they? Oh no! The gods! The ones they crafted the End Magnus with! What? Ghost of the gods? This just gets better and better!
It seems we may have more trouble than we bargained for. The great Mizuti be invincible. Utterly. Totally. But not against ghosts. Not quite. Exception. Don't worry. If we can hit them, we can defeat them. You be sure? Positive. I hate ghosts too. What is it? Um, nothing. Huh. Let's get a move on. We don't have time for ghost stories. I think we'll get a move on next episode. I'm gonna have to do my deck. Well, I'll do my deck this episode. Let's do decks this episode. I could probably drop some of my defensive items. So now I have so many attacks. I feel like it might be the best plan. You don't really use black. I won't give you that. You don't use green either. Well, I haven't managed to drop many of his defensive items, have I? All. Well, no change in balance then. You don't really use... well, uh, how many reds do you actually have then? Five. Mm. You have a lot of green. I don't want any wind in the deck. I can't re uh, actually, maybe I can rely more on them because I have more in my hand, I think. That's enough. Again, I really don't want to give you more blacks. It's just not helpful. Oh, I don't see all those side quests we did. It doesn't seem like I've done anything particularly good. That's blue, get rid of the blue because he used red defense. I got some good defensive items, I guess. Mind you, you don't seem to have much of a pattern with regards to your um, defense. If you have the same colors as your offense, I think it'll make my life easier. And then we can give the others to, um, to the Bari. black. Only you can use that. Then you're not going to. wasn't a breakthrough that I expected. I'll see you next episode where we'll fight these monsters.